do 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 Robin Sunshine do 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 Woo Hi, I'm Robin Sunshine bringing you a little sunshine today. So, welcome back to Testimony Spotlight where um people share their testimony how they accepted Christ as their savior. I was interviewing my great grandpa and um and kind of cool things that um I did not know was that he was in the navy and I was like, "Wow, I didn't know that, grandpa." And so today he is a cherry cherry farmer and um, my great grandpa Richard okay so your first question is um, when did you accept Jesus into your life well of course I come from a Christian family and I can remember my grandparents were uh, very well versed in, in Christianity and, and uh, so we <clears throat> we came up in that kind of an atmosphere uh, it's not something that came on to us quite suddenly it's something that uh, we grew up with but by the same token we had to make a, our own decision and uh, I would probably say I was about seven years old, and that's, uh, and I'm 86 now, so you see, it was a while ago. So, your second question is, what ch changed in your life after accepting Christ? I can't say that. <clears throat> There's really that much change because I grew up with it. See what I mean? Uh, you know, like I said, I lived in that kind of atmosphere. Should have done. The encouragement for us that are living for Jesus. You mean what you should be doing? Uh, like encouragement, like, like live your life. Okay. Fully to the okay, or you know. Well, first of all, uh, I do believe that the Bible should be adhered to. That's the the main thing, that, because everything that God and Jesus and the apostles and anybody in the Bible you know, would would want you to do, it's there. And, uh, you know, I read the Bible every day. And that's something that I feel as though should be adhered to. Um, prayer, I firmly believe in prayer. It's not just something you, you yak about and, and I hope that... Uh, Somebody's listening to you. You know there's somebody on the other end. And as you ask for the right things that would be according to his will, uh, you're doing what he wants you to do. Thanks for watching. Jesus loves you!